Welcome back to Lake Ridden. At the end of the last episode, we solved this puzzle, got a giant key, and used it to unlock this door. So let's see what's inside. like a thing I can push. Does that look rather suspicious? Can't seem to actually push it though. March 4th, 1905. It is such a mess up here, but the table will be a great hiding place. The old master thought I would never figure out how it worked. He should see me now. I don't think any of them saw me put it in there. It's better they don't know. The table will be a great hiding place. I guess I should keep an eye out for a table. Also, what is this? Can't open it. Well, this has got to be the table, right? ship. read what they say, and I don't think you're meant to. In fact, that just looks like gibberish. It's just about the pictures, and I think especially there's some things written. Yeah, like down here. Each book has some stuff written. This one has E1... S3? is missing. Yeah. I mean, it looks similar to the contraption back at the projector. I could take that tube and put it there? Am I supposed to? Perhaps. I think a piece is missing. I think a piece is missing. Don't think it's the knife. <laughs> I think a piece is missing. I think I might need that tube. Let me go grab it. Yeah, this one we can take back. I think it's only that, though. Yeah, we can't take anything else. Aha! Uh -huh. So... That's taking the light from this lantern, and then this is reflecting it... ...over there somewhere? I mean, that sh looks like it's at, like, a... ...set to reflect it at a... ...90-degree angle. Should go up, hit it, and then come out this way. Just go straight. Uh, 
I don't get it. So I gotta go the right way. Is it gonna reset or anything like that? Looking for some feedback. But I'm not getting any. Hmm. Um, let's take a look at the notes. I took pictures of the front of each book, which is where the the directions are, like west, north, east, south. Those are definitely cardinal directions meant for the Viking ship. And then there's a question of what is the order to put them in, and I'm guessing it's probably by alphabetical order of the book's title. Because looking inside of the books, there's nothing in them that's really useful. I mean, there's some cool illustrations, but I couldn't find anything in the contents of any of them that would indicate an order. Mostly just nonsense and drawings. So I think it's alphabetical. I've arranged them in that order and taken pictures of each one. So from the start position, first up we have Aram Domum. West one, north one. So west one, north one. Then Historia Naturalis. East one, north two. East one, north two. Then we have Liber. West one, north two. West one, north two. Then... Um, does that say memoirs or memories? Memories in life? Something like that. Anyway, west three, south two. The west one, two, three, south, two. Then Sonnengot, E1, uh, east one, south three. East one, south three. Oh, that feels good. I got that puzzle right away. Wow. What the heck? Where am I? What's that light? Marie, what is this place? Sophia, are you here somewhere? Marie, I can't hear you. I don't know what happened. I heard you calling out for me in the woods. But my body, it had a mind of its own. And now I'm stuck. You have to help me get out of here. She couldn't hear me even when I was shouting her name. I looked around, but I couldn't see her anywhere. But hearing her voice was comforting. I was on the right track. I thought that maybe the blue light was leading me to her. But it wasn't quite that simple. Hey, will you wake up? You've been sleeping all day, while I've been looking for the other girl. I still haven't found her, though. Did you find something up here? I found, um... Uh, I don't know what it was. When I opened it, I saw the brightest light. He must have knocked me out. I had the weirdest dream. A dream? I love dreams. What was it about? I could hear Sophia calling for me. And there was this blue light. How exciting! A blue light! You know, Miss Nelly talked about a blue light. 
We should talk to her. Take the lift down in the courtyard while I look around the lake. We're playing hide and seek, and she's really good at it. Before I go to the courtyard, it looks like I have access to a whole new wing of the estate. Don't really need the lantern anymore. Another child's drawing. I know we don't really need light, but I still gotta light everything up. Fire hazards be damned. So these are children's rooms. Uh, what about the room I was just in? There's a couple cribs. And yeah, this room over here is definitely meant for a bunch of children. So this is where they, uh, what, abducted the children to? <laughs> like, I don't know if they actually abducted them, but it sure seems like they wanted to. This is now linked up with the part of the house we've already been to. This door was locked before. Ooh. So pretty. there. So much to explore. Not actually finding very much though, most of it's quite empty. Miss Nelly told me that people in town have begun talking about the estate. For some reason they seem to disapprove that I took in the children, and their mothers. Something about being unchristian, whatever that means. It doesn't matter what they think, I have more important things to care about took in the children. How did you take them in, huh? I don't know 
where to start. I guess here. The kids have moved in and their mothers. I must say that I'm surprised at how quiet the children are. I expected them to run around and scream and make noises. They have not asked about my inventions yet. Perhaps they'll come around to it. Meanwhile, I shall make toys for them. I might still have some springs or fireworks lying around. I can imagine the smile on their faces when I bring them gifts. Maybe, maybe not the fireworks for the kids though. It sounds a little dangerous. To the little treehouse, or not really a treehouse, just a clubhouse, I guess, cabin. And we visited that a little bit ago. Yes, light up the candle in direct sunlight. They all look very unhappy, and there's rain clouds over them. Now we've linked up with the part of the house that we've been in. Okay. Ah. I think that might be all of the areas. Uh, actually, no. No, I haven't been over here at all. Side looks so different now that it's in daylight. We've been here. Oh yeah, it's just another place to get to the area where we first came in. Mm, I'm still missing an area or two, I feel like. Maybe not. Actually, I think that is everything. All the doors are open. Lights are needlessly lit. Oh, hold on. Oh, I can't light those. If only I could light those. So this is like the back area that I haven't explored yet said that there's a lift in the courtyard. Courtyard would probably be out front, right? Oh, 
This feels like a sort of semi-open world area. There's a lot of ways to go. Like down there, there's a bunch of buildings. Oh, can't go this way. There's also the backyard. Let's go to the backyard. This also goes down to the... I don't know what that is. It's not a village. I guess it's just... Well, it is an estate. Just other houses and... I mean, that looks like a barn. That looks like a house. Summer and spring, the flowers they weep, I take the tears and put it in your hands. That sounds like a clue to a puzzle. And this thing here on the table looks like a puzzle, but I can't interact with it. the sun. I think the only area to go to now is actually towards the other buildings. What had happened to Sophia? The ghost had not put my mind at ease, but she gave me the only lead I had to go on. I put all my hope into finding Miss Nolly. for the last step. There we go. The gardener complained about the new gates. What does he know about running an estate? I must think of the safety of everyone, and of my inventions. We have construction workers running around in the lower garden, and who knows what they might do. I do not trust them one bit. One of them had an eye patch. Is he a pirate? I cannot have pirates in my backyard. That's why I put up the gates. Pirates cannot use gates. Everyone knows that. 
<laughs> what? More construction worker hate. There's an alternative entrance to this house. Nope, just that one door. God. I think this might be the lift. That's a lot of levers. I think each lever is going to make a musical note and we're going to have to copy it. But before that, let's keep exploring. everything. Normally we could take the stairs up there, but they're broken. So we have to take the lift. These don't make a noise? Three positions. Ah, the notes. There's only three notes. Three positions for each lever, and only three notes. So the pitch of each note, I think, tells you the the positioning of the lever. Right, if it's the lowest note, then it probably is supposed to be all the way down. Medium note, middle, highest note, it's supposed to be at the top. Let's count how many notes play. One, two, three, four, 
five, six, seven, eight. Yep, that's it. Okay. the first five are right. Medium, low. Medium, high. Wait, no, no. Low. Low, medium. High. Medium, low. Low, medium, high. And then medium low? Yes. I noticed the stairs to the root cellar are in grave condition. Therefore, I have created a mechanical lift. Jack asked why I didn't just have a new stair built. Obviously, he does not understand. Jack is just a simple groundskeeper. As always, he's critical of my creations. Why do we need more than one lever? He asked. Isn't it a little complicated? That does it. I'm not giving him the right settings for the levers. Einar is just such an asshole. Basically, the, their attitude seems to be, fuck all people who do manual labor. Uh, also, I want to steal children. Because they make me feel sort of warm when they hug my leg. letter to myself. You mustn't open the door until you're absolutely sure that it's gone. The door can't be opened from up here. If you're still in control of your senses, I'm sure you'll figure it out. There is a concoction that will open your eyes. What? This looks like a connect the dot star constellation kind of thing. Probably going to be important. Let's just light this whole place up and then explore it. Oh, yeah, we got some constellations there. Why can't I light this one? Fake candle. Oh, I can light each of these. 